Hey, welcome to One Verse. My name is Matt. One of my uh, passions that I love to talk about at the Phosphorus Project, which, which One Verse is a part of the Phosphorus Project, is uh, growing our faith, finding our purpose, and the third one is loving our families well. And so for today and tomorrow, I'm going to look at two different verses that have to do with family life. And since I'm um, a husband and a father, that's where I speak from. And so I'm going to really talk to, to parents um, tomorrow, but especially husbands um, and fathers tomorrow specifically, but husbands today. And so I just want to share with this with you, but, but wise, I think um, you'll enjoy this as well. It comes out of Ephesians chapter 5 and verse 25, and it says, Husbands, love your wives just as Christ loved the church and gave himself up for her. Now, let's be honest and not talk about, you know, I don't want to miss the elephant in the room. If you're familiar with this passage, you're probably familiar with the fact that Ephesians 5 gets a bad rap sometimes because a few verses earlier is that dreaded S word, submit, all right? So earlier it talks about submission and wives and this and that, and it gets so blown out of proportion in our church because we don't really understand the word. But this is what it comes down to, is this verse right here. It has nothing to do with like wives listening to their husbands and doing everything they say. That's just such a, a perverted uh, version of the word. No, this is the point of this passage. Husbands, love your wives as Christ loved the church. So let's see here. Uh, he lived um, uh, for others. He came to the earth. He uh, met their needs. He loved them. He fed them. He took care of them. And, and then he died for them um, and offered them salvation. Now, we can't do all that for our wives. Matter of fact, I'm, very, I'm married to a very independent, strong woman who would do fine taking care of herself but she allows me to speak into her life and to help her and to help meet some of her needs. And it's a beautiful picture. But see, we're called husbands to love our life like Jesus who died for the church. So until you're willing to, to give everything away for your wife, then you still have room to grow. So let's not get so worried about on if our wives are submitting to us and let's maybe worry more about how well we're loving our wives. Have a great day.